Have you ever self-sabotaged something that you claimed you wanted? If so, you're definitely not alone. Welcome to Tapping Tuesday. Today we are going to be talking about how to stay out of your own way when opportunities show up for you. Imagine that you just learned about an exciting opportunity or something that you've wanted to happen finally does. Right? So you're feeling excited, you're feeling like, oh my gosh, I can't believe this is really happening. Or it's something that's finally possible for you. So you're feeling excited and you're in that right place to take the next step that might just change your life. And then, what happens? Self-doubt sets in. Maybe it's thoughts that are along the lines of, this is a lot all at once. I've never done this before. What if I can't do it? What if I can't keep up? What if I'm not ready, right? Or whatever other limiting thoughts that may come up in your mind. And for some reason, there is a resistance or a fear around this great opportunity that has just been presented to you. And um, strangely, it's almost as if you are now rejecting this thing or opportunity that you actually wanted. So what's up with that? Where does this come from? What do we do and how do we fix it, right? So first, let's take a pause. And before we get swept away with all of the what ifs, let's take a moment to just enjoy and appreciate the moment, the opportunity, whatever this great thing is that you are now feeling a little bit of fear around. And a great way to celebrate this, to be in the moment, is with a celebration tap. So I'll give you an example of what that might look, out, look like. Very easy, very simple, and something that honestly I recommend you do as much as you can about good things that happen or things that you're excited about or things that um, maybe you weren't excited about, but you made it through and you're proud and you're giving yourself a pat on the back. So demo of a celebratory tap in this instance aimed towards a great or amazing new opportunity, right? So we can just start on the top of the head being like, this is amazing. This is a great opportunity for me. I'm so excited. I've been thinking about this and it's finally happened. It just fell right in my lap this amazing opportunity. I can't believe it. Okay, something like that. Nice, easy breath. <sighs> right, so we're feeling good. We're feeling like, oh yeah, we're, we're um, buzzing in the, the high vibration of the celebration, right? So it's possible that um, some of the self-doubt, those fears, limiting beliefs that surfaced when you started thinking, oh, this amazing thing is coming my way. Can I handle it? With a celebratory tap, maybe some of those has disappeared and that's great. But chances are they have not all dissipated, right? So in that case, it's time to revisit those remaining doubts because the more we try to ignore them, they're just going to get louder the closer we get to taking action. So we're going to jump right into the tapping here. So starting on the side of the hand, repeat after me and um, follow along. Even though I have this amazing opportunity, I feel some resistance around it. I accept this and completely love and accept myself. Even though I feel a little fear, around this opportunity that I now have. The what ifs are going full force. I choose to completely love and accept myself. Even though I wanted this opportunity and now that I have it, I'm afraid I'll ruin it somehow. I accept these feelings and I'm open to exploring this. Okay, top of the head this fear, this resistance to allowing myself to receive this opportunity. This is something I wanted. 
and now I have doubts. I know this could be great, and I could also really mess it up. So maybe I shouldn't even try. This resistance, this fear, to taking the next step, fear around this opportunity. I've never done this before. Resistance around this opportunity. What if I'm not ready? There are so many things that could happen. What if it doesn't go well? Resistance around this opportunity. What if I can't do it? Fear around this opportunity. I want this, but I'm not ready. This fear and resistance. I choose to accept this fear and resistance because my body is just trying to keep me safe and I give myself permission to release these thoughts now just because I think them doesn't make them true it's possible for me to take this opportunity and still be safe. I give myself permission to start before I'm ready. I've survived 100% of the things I've tried so far. That's a pretty good track record. I can do big things. This opportunity is happening for me. It's a gift. And I choose to receive it with so much gratitude. I trust the universe will guide me to take the right steps and actions in ways that feel easy and aligned for me. I can do this. And I choose to be excited for this opportunity. All right, let that go. Take a shake, a wiggle if you need. Nice, easy breath as always, in through the nose, out through the mouth. <sighs> okay, so just tune in, notice how you're feeling, what's going on if you're still noticing other, um, you know, fears, resistances, those what ifs that are popping up. It's very possible. Um, dare I say likely that there are still some things that are coming up for you some you know kind of side thoughts being like well yeah I want to believe that it's gonna be great but but anything that ends with the but is something worth uh, pursuing and exploring a little bit more um, but this is a great way and place to start with this tap that we just did so of course please reach out if you would like help working through any fears or resistance that are standing in the way of you taking the next right step for you because everybody's different every action is going to be specific to the individual so we want to make sure that whatever you're working through is personalized so if that's something that you would like if you would you know enjoy having more assistance reach out that's why i'm here um Please do share this with someone who you think might need to hear it. And of course, come back next week for another Tapping Tuesday. As always, take care and keep shining.